Hello friends, how are you? In this video lecture today we will see basic strength of gonadine and resonance effect. Gonadine is a colorless solid which dissolves in polar solvent. This is the property of gonadine. It is colorless solid which dissolves in polar solvent. Second, it is used in production of plastics and explosives and in the manufacturing of plastic and explosive gonadine is used. Remember gonadine occurs in urine as a normal product of protein metabolism. This is about occurrence. Number one, gonadine is colorless solid. It is colorless solid. Dissolves in polar solvent. It is used in the production of plastics and explosives. It is found in urine as a normal product of protein metabolism. See here, this is the structure of gonadine. So this carbon is surrounded by three nitrogen atoms with lone pair of electron. So this is carbon nitrogen single bond. Here it is a carbon nitrogen single bond. But here there is a carbon nitrogen double bond. So remember this is said to be imine. Carbon nitrogen double bonded compound is said to be imine. So this linkage is said to be imine. So here on each nitrogen there is one lone pair of electron. So this is Lewis base. Lewis base an electron pair donor. It is electron pair donor. And here three electron pair donor atoms are there. But question arises that which nitrogen will donate pair of electron very easily. Whether nitrogen from these two or nitrogen from this imine group. See here, this lone pair of electron, whatever lone pair of electron is present on nitrogen. This lone pair is present in conjugation and a lone pair, single bond and here it is a double bond. Yani this lone pair is involved in resonance effect like this. Because hybridization of this carbon is sp2. And sp2 hybridized carbon and it is electronegative. Yani it is electron acceptor. And this lone pair is present in conjugation. Lone pair, single bond and here it is double bond. And these two electrons are involved in a resonance and there is a delocalization of these two electrons. Similarly, this lone pair is also present in conjugation. Lone pair, single bond and then double bond. And here also resonance is possible like this in a delocalization of these two electrons like this. Isn't it? So here, on third nitrogen, which is the part of imine, here a double bond sigma and pi. So after breaking of this pi bond, shifting of both electrons towards nitrogen, because here a nitrogen is more electronegative compared to carbon, and there is more electron density around to this nitrogen. In a nitrogen of this imine, will donate pair of electrons very easily. When is called protonation kiya? A proton. Just we have seen nitrogen from this imine will donate pair of electron to this. And is nitrogen ka protonation hoga like this. Jab a nitrogen pair of electron donate karega to a positive charge acquire karega. A H plus negative charge acquire karega. Negative positive a cancel hoga is nitrogen pe abhi a positive charge yani here it is like this 
ये कॉन्जुगेट एसिड है गोनेडिन का सो दिस इज गोनेडिन दिस इज स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ गोनेडिन एंड दिस इज कॉन्जुगेट एसिड ऑफ गोनेडिन पी के ए ऑफ गोनेडिन इज ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव एन एड स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस ए स्ट्रॉन्ग ऑर्गेनिक बेस है आफ्टर प्रोटोनेशन इट गिवस कॉन्जुगेट एसिड ऑफ गोनेडिन which is resonance stabilized by resonance effect so here there is a stabilization of this e electron deficient nitrogen so shifting of this lone pair of electron towards electronegative carbon yani yahan pe double bond banega after formation of pi bond here up double bond so breaking of pi bond and shifting of electrons towards nitrogen like this so here double bond is there now this nitrogen is electron deficient because this nitrogen is electron donor so by donating it will acquire positive charge to so, a positive charge yahan pe now what is second resonating structure now this nitrogen will donate pair of electron to this carbon electronegative carbon ab yahan pe double bond banega so this carbon will be pentavalent 1 2 3 4 and 5 so breaking up pi bond and shifting up electrons towards nitrogen Since this nitrogen is going to donate pair of electrons, so will acquire positive charge. So यहाँ पे ये positive charge, a double bond. Now यहाँ पे single bond होगा, like this. And then there is a delocalization of charge. Here positive charge is present on nitrogen, on this nitrogen. In next resonating structure, positive charge is present on this nitrogen. In next resonating structure, positive charge is present on nitrogen. And there is a delocalization of charge. This delocalization is said to be symmetrical. And this is symmetrical resonance. And a conjugate acid of gonadin is stabilized by symmetrical resonance. Isn't it equal distribution, equal migration of electrons? so that is why this gonadin is a strong base isn't it gonadin is a strong base because a lot of electrons are available here on each nitrogen there is one lone pair of electron and a lot of electron density is there in a three lone pair of electrons are available three lone pair but out of three nitrogen nitrogen from imine will donate pair of electron very easily because this nitrogen is electron rich more electron rich because after breaking up pi bond shifting up both pi electrons towards nitrogen to e iska conjugate acid hua iska resonance hoga iska stabilization by resonating structures shifting of lone pair like this then breaking up this e nitrogen electron donate karega in a positive charge e yahan pe positive charge now shifting of these two electrons and a migration of this lone this lone pair of electron yahan pe double bond banega to ek pi bond break ho gaya shifting of electrons towards electron deficient nitrogen atom yani next resonating structure this is structure number 1 structure number 2 and structure number 3 there is a migration of positive charge yahan pe in next structure yahan pe in next structure yahan pe yani conjugate acid is stabilized by equilibrium resonance so that is why gonadin is very strong base pka of this is 12.5 is it clear if any doubt keep your doubt in comment box if you are new to this channel please like it subscribe it and share it thank you